Ah, uh, the start of an evolution video. Where the nostalgia is. If this video doesn't give you nostalgia, I don't know what will. Basically, here's some footage from season one by Dakotas, and he is just popping with the SMG. It's just awesome. People didn't like it at the time, but this is the first ever SMG, and this was a standard SMG, which soon got removed. Yes, that's right, around February of 2018, the SMG in Fortnite did get removed, except the tactical SMG stayed. If you want more nostalgia, just look at this. OG Fortnite in Pleasant Park with the tactical SMG. Also, credit to BF4Gamer for this footage because I, well, I was an OG, but I don't have any good footage myself of it. So go check out BF4Gamer and check out this kill. Yeah, this weapon lasted its fair bit, but then it got removed. Again, another SMG down. But luckily, the recent addition of the silenced SMG, which had happened about a month before this got vaulted, I believe, has made SMGs still a thing. Now this weapon was pretty sneaky, in fact, just the grey rarity of a silenced SMG can pack a punch of 153 damage per second, with 17 damage per shot and a whopping 42.5 headshot damage, that's just 10 less than some pump shotguns these days. The gun was intense, especially if you were in a bush even though nobody does that these days. Little did I know that soon this amazing drum gun would be released and it's OP as hell. Nobody was ever able to get so many kills so quickly before. It was amazing and then again like two other SMGs, you guessed it, it got vaulted. But of course, there's a loop here, there's a pattern here we're following. So, again, a new P90 was added before the drum gun was vaulted. And then after that, Fortnite actually brought back the brand new SMG, which is new and improved. So now these days, we refer to these guns as OP. I didn't even know you can get a grey P90, but right there, it is. And the grey P90, the funny thing is, it does 170 DPS with 34 headshot damage, but the fire rate's really good. 10 shots, I believe that's per second. And the legendary one does 210 damage with 21 damage regular and 42 damage headshot so it can melt someone and the improved submachine guns this one 228 that's even more than the p90 and the p90 is awesome the cool thing about it Actually, I prefer that to a submachine. You get better aim with it, at least I believe. But all of these SMGs are really overpowered now and people just overuse them. They spam it and they win every single 1v1 in history. Here's some footage I actually have from the P90 showing how OP it can be in a 1v1. And because you'll want longer videos, I've actually put the effort in to actually add this extra segment in. It's basically just another video I've made, but you can go check it out. It's called Pointless 1v1 with Pork GG. 
and it's actually relevant to this video because it actually has a clip from the new P90 gun and how OP it can be. Like, I melted pork and I didn't even hit every single shot. And you know, I won this 1v1 battle because this is editing, but I won it because of the gun. Honorable mention to Jonta is Ninja XD for suggesting this. And this is actually going to lead to a series where I talk about the evolution of different guns. And the evolution of Fortnite series is actually gaining a lot of views. So I'd like to thank you all for them too. Anyway, it's Scallywag out.